Hi, my name is Mark Tapazian. I'm a gastroenterologist at Mayo Clinic, and I'm talking today about treatment of painful chronic pancreatitis. Chronic pancreatitis is a chronic condition caused by scarring and swelling and irritation of the pancreas. And the main symptom is pain. The pain has a number of possible causes. Sometimes it's from irritated nerve endings in and around the pancreas. Other times it's from blockage of the pancreas duct, which is a tube that drains digestive juices from the pancreas into the intestine. Other people have leakage of pancreas juice from the pancreas duct, forming a pseudocyst or a pocket of fluid next to the pancreas. Others have a persistent swelling of part or all of the pancreas. And there may even be a blockage of some adjacent organs, such as the intestine or the bile duct, by swelling in the pancreas. So in someone with pain from chronic pancreatitis, we start with imaging tests to see what's going on with their pancreas. Often these would be CT scans or an MRI scan. And during the MRI, we often give a drug called secretin, which helps the pancreas secrete juice into the intestine during the scan and can help us tell if there's a blockage to flow of juice from the pancreas. Treatments for painful chronic pancreatitis include medicines, endoscopic procedures, and surgery. Medicines are often our first choice. They're the least invasive alternative, and they may be medicines to rest the pancreas or to treat neuropathic pain, which means pain from irritated nerve endings. Endoscopic treatments include a procedure called ERCP, and we often do this at Mayo to treat blockages of the pancreas duct by putting stents or pieces of tubing in the pancreas duct that prop it open and help the juice flow from the pancreas into the intestine. We can also use endoscopy, ERCP, or a, a procedure called endoscopic ultrasound to drain pseudocysts or pockets of pancreas fluid into the intestine and relieve pain. Still other people need surgery for their painful chronic pancreatitis, and the surgeon may operate to provide another way for juice to drain from the pancreas duct into the intestine, or may remove part or even all of the pancreas, and in the case of removing all the pancreas, return the pilot cells, the insulin-producing cells of the pancreas, back to the patient. Which of these treatments is best for any individual person depends a lot on what the details are of, of the situation, the imaging tests, and what's going on with their pancreas. Fortunately, at Mayo, we have a multidisciplinary team that does this sort of thing. So we have gastroenterologists like myself, we have pain specialists, we have surgeons who focus on pancreatic surgery, and we put our, our minds and thoughts together trying to come up with the best plan for each individual. So that's treatment of painful chronic pancreatitis in a nutshell. I wish you success.